हे माई नेम इज हैप्पी आई हेल्प कैंडिडेट्स इन डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन इन एनी इंटरव्यू इफ यू हैव एनी कन्फ्यूजन इन एनी इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन देन पोस्ट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड आई विल मेक एन वीडियो ऑन इट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस क्वेश्चन फर्स्ट टाइप इज सिंगल इनहेरिटेंस यू कैन सी दिस इज द सिंपलेस्ट वन हेयर वी हैव वन प्लेस क्लास एंड ओनली वन ड्राइव क्लास so let's see the code also so here we can see we have one base class 1 and this base class 1 is derived in this derived class 1 so this is the simplest type of inheritance single inheritance second type of inheritance is multiple inheritance in this case we can have multiple base classes like base class 1 and base class 2 and have only one derived class remember in c sharp multiple inheritance can be achieved with the help of interfaces only which means we can have only one base class and the other base class should be or i can say must be the interface and there can be n number of interfaces so let's see the code also see here we have this base class 2 and we have one interface i2 now we have one derived class 2 which is inherited inherited from this base class 2 and the i2 interface so if i will replace or if i will try to replace this i2 interface with some base class then it is not possible and it will give an, an compile time error because multiple inheritance is not uh, possible in c sharp via the base classes it's only possible via the interfaces and here with i2 we can have i3 i4 any number of interfaces so this is the second type of inheritance next type of inheritance is multi level inheritance here we have one derived class uh, one, sorry one base class which is then derived into one derived class and then this derived class 1 will again be inherited from this derived class 2 uh, let me show you the code then it will be much clear so see we have this base class 3 as the base class or you can say it is the grand parent uh, which is derived in the parent class which is derived class 3 and then this is the child class derived class 4 which is derived from the derived class 3 so it is basically you can say that grand parent then parent and then the child kind of relationship and here the child which is derived class 4 will get the properties and methods of both the parent base class 2 and the grand parent base class 3 so it will get the properties and methods of both of these above classes now the next type of the inheritance is the hierarchical inheritance now in case of hierarchical inheritance we have one base class and we have multiple derived class like this derived class 1 derived class 2 and derived class 3 this is the most used type of inheritance because uh, mostly in the application we have one base class and then we are driving it in multiple derived class uh here is the code it is pretty simple we have one base class 4 and then this base class 4 in is derived in derived class 5 and uh, this base class 4 is again derived in derived class 6 so basically this is the last type of the inheritance which is hierarchical inheritance uh just remind you again base parent and super class are the same thing and child derived and sub classes are the same thing i hope this illustration and diagram has cleared your concepts regarding the types of interfaces oh sorry types of inheritance so now uh in next question we will see some more things about the oops and c sharp